Hello to everyone here tonight, and in particular, my new best friend, Fantasia, over there. <laughs> we are all incredibly lucky to be together here tonight, and we have to thank SAG for that. And I'm incredibly lucky to honor uh, an amazing woman, Lily Gladstone. Collaborating alongside her was one of the highlights of my career, and I continue to stand in awe of her extraordinary performance in Killers of the Flower Moon. Let's give her a hand of applause for that. She truly embodied the soul of our film. Her wisdom and depth of personal character helped guide both Martin Scorsese and myself to tell this tremendously sinister and painful part of our nation's history. Lily's performance was not just acting, it was shape-shifting, as Martin Scorsese likes to call it. In order to become Molly, Lily drew upon experiences from her own grandmother, experiences that she must have had during that very same era. I had the privilege of being on set every day to witness her incredible transformation, to watch her physically take on not just the, the character, but also the very soul of Molly Burkhart. She brought with her all the history, all the pain, and the resilience of an Osage woman whose story became the very heartbeat of our picture. Although she's given numerous critically acclaimed performances in the past in films like Fancy Dance and Certain Women, when we first met, I learned that Lily was on the verge of quitting acting altogether. Yet an actor of such profound talent has found it a long and hard road to get this recognition speaks to the unfairness that still exists in our industry today. I fervently hope that we're entering a new era in which actors like Lily, who embody this authenticity and undeniable truth in their own storytelling, take center stage. Because Lily's not just an actor, she's also an activist. An activist who truly brings others with her as, as she did with me filming Killers of the Flower Moon. Her tireless and passionate efforts reflect a commitment to rectifying systematic issues within our country and tribal communities. Her work with the National Indigenous Women's Resource Center, a native-led nonprofit organization dedicated to ending violence against Native American, Alaska Native, and Native Hawaiian women is a deep part of who she is. Her influence with the NGO Noise, its focus on missing and murdered indigenous relatives has been a crucial part of her life's work. Lily, I just wanna tell you I am filled with immense pride that we're able to tell this story together, that we did this film together. It was a necessary truth. It was a truth about how much has been stolen from the Native Americans, the systematic violence towards Native women, and a story that it, at its very heart is a microcosm for the ongoing persecution of Native, Native Americans that still exist today. Ladies and gentlemen, please join me in celebrating a kind, wise, and humble soul, a tremendous talent, and an incredibly important voice of change, my very good friend, Lily Gladstone.